Bonsoir à tout le monde et bienvenue dans un nouvel épisode de Assassin's Creed Odyssey. Et aujourd'hui on continue euh, pardon, notre aventure pour euh, euh, essayer de découvrir plus de choses sur notre mer. Et en fait j'ai vu que dans les quêtes qui nous sont proposées, il y a la, il y a la quête de, du Maquignon, donc pour libérer euh, euh, Corinthe de l'influence de Maquignon, du Maquignon. Euh, mais c'est au 22. Et en fait j'ai vu que la quête... Euh, à Argos, elle est niveau 19, donc plus équivalente à mon niveau. Donc je pense qu'on va aller, aller faire, je pense qu'on va aller faire celle-là et on va euh, continuer l'histoire, mais en fait dans une autre ville. Alors je vais vérifier que j'enregistre quand même. C'est quand même con d'enregistrer pour rien. Et voilà. Donc on se dirige à Argos, qui est Vers le sud. Ouais, vers le sud. Mm -hmm, Midas. Ok, bon, en fait, il faut tout traverser. Ok. On va se passer rapidement ici. Ok. Donc c'est par là. Est-ce que j'ai survécu à ça <rire> Oula. Alors je tiens à dire que la manette elle bug un peu. Hein. Alors là on est où Waouh ils sont 3D Par là Donc l'établissement d'Hippocrate est dans Argolis. L'établissement est dans la partie nord-est de la ville d'Argos. Il est au sud de l'oracle sanglante. Ok. Argos. Nous y sommes. Mais je ne suis pas la bienvenue ici. Hippocrates Clinic. Come on, come on, come on. Arrête de danser. Tout à 
Ouais, exprès. Ok. Look, you insignificant peon. Tell me where he is, or by Ira, I'll burn this clinic to the ground with you in it. I already told you what I know. I don't ask much. Hippocrates must show humility to ensure public order. Prostrate himself before the gods and declare that his skills are gods given. But that won't help his patients. It'll just take him away from his work. If Hippocrates thinks he can disrupt social order to make himself into a demigod of healing, well, perhaps the gods themselves will have their revenge. Mm -hmm. I'm sure there's no need for raised voices. Who are you? I'm looking for a man named Hippocrates. Yet another crazed follower of the madman himself. Tell your impious master that unless he makes a public apology and soon, this priestess of Ira will gather an army of faithful and shut him Une armée de fidèles. Out of my way. Uh, bye, hein? Oh, thank all the gods she's gone. I thought she was going to kill me this time. What's going on? I am Sostratos. Crisis has accused my master Hippocrates of impiety. Is he impious? He believes that beyond praying, people can take their health into their own hands and make themselves well. Fascinating. Can I speak with him? Wow, la médecine. I need to meet Hippocrates. Yes, but he's gone southeast of Hera's watch to help the sick and injured. Is this his workshop? It's Hippocrates' clinic. Here we study healing, offer treatments, and provide care to anyone who asks. Why not work with the priests in the sanctuary of Asclepios? It's what this region is known for, right? The priests try their best, but their methods are stuck in the past. Hippocrates is researching new cures and treatments. I'll find him. If you're going to meet Hippocrates, could I trouble you with a small errand? Come to Jor. what it is. I want you to bring him some equipment. He was in such a hurry, he left it behind. What kind of equipment? It's just medical necessities. Knives and gut for sutures, bandages. Oh, and uh, an enema bag for clearing the bowels. That had better be properly wrapped. <laughs> I could bring that to Hippocrates. Really? My services. Quand même, comme dirait le Joker, ne fais jamais gratuitement quelque chose que tu fais, que tu sais bien faire. Perhaps Hippocrates can teach you something about helping those in need when you speak with him. How will I know who I'm looking for? Head southeast of Hera's watch, near the cave of Pan. He'll be standing before a long line of sick people. You'll know him by his um, bald spot, though I wouldn't mention it. Okay. So many sick people. Can one man help all of them? Peut-être c'est un charlatan. J'avais pas besoin de faire ça. J'aurais pu le tuer directement, mais. Ce son n'était pas très réaliste. Hein. Ah, ça c'est un... Ouais, c'est ça. On va synchroniser le lieu, comme ça on a un point... Et Ryan d'Argos. Tout, tout, tout. 
Voilà. Ah, je pense que c'est là-haut. Tellement beau. Putain, mais je comprends pas, hein. Niveau 22, oh là là. La grotte de Pan. I thought they were exaggerating when they said people from all around came to see Hippocrates. <laughs> so, what has caused this man's condition? An excess of phlegm, doctor. In the immediate sense, yes. But more importantly, he suffers from neglect. Neglect? Good food, warm clothing, so much could have helped. But since other caretakers assumed his condition was a punishment from the gods they neglected him challenging tradition huh. you must be hippocrates yes i'm also very busy this will only take a moment i won't keep you away from your patients and your students observation experience and experimentation are crucial for treatment my followers are learning that i've come from your clinic in argos Sostratos asked me to give you this. I knew I forgot some things. Sostratos is a good physician, but a better apprentice there is none. Did you ask him to pay you for this delivery? Of course I did. I'm a Mystios. Ungenerous, but honest at least. What can I call you, Mystios? Alexios of Sparta. What did you come here for, Alexios of Sparta? Hippocrates, I need your help. I was told you may have helped my mother. I'm trying to find her. But we see all kinds of mothers. They walk all day so that Hippocrates can see their children. Maybe the priests at the sanctuary of Asclepios can help. They keep detailed records of all who passed by. Oh. Please, Hippocrates, I came very far to meet you. As did this patient, and the one before him, and the one before her. My patients need me, but my notes on diseases of the mind were taken. Retrieve them and I will help you find what you seek. Okay. Sorry, this patient doesn't have much time left. Where should I look for your notes? Fort Tyrins, not far from here. Ah, in Forteresse, forcément. Or they could prepare for a new battle. With me. Far be it for me to tell Amistios how to work, but please, for my sake, do not kill needlessly. Enough blood has been shed in this war. Did Chrysis take your notes? Ah, you've met the priestess. No, not her, but the local military commander. I can't fault his desperation. Those men suffered terribly from battle fatigue. She would have come here a long time ago. With I was a young man then. When I encountered a situation beyond my skills, I would send the patient to the sanctuary. And these priests keep records of their patients. Yes, engraved in stone. The elder priest might. Putain, dans la, dans la pierre, hein. Ça, ça part pas. Hein. What was so interesting about these notes? They were my notes about diseases of the mind, including what the priests call the sacred disease. That's what this patient has. He's losing control of his limbs and throat, sometimes frothing at the mouth. I fear his breathing will stop next. De l'épilepsie. According to Sostratos, you don't like people mentioning your... You know. 
My what? Your hair. Or lack of it. Yes. Yes. Make your jokes while walking around like one of Phidias' sculptures come to life. <laughs> I'll do my best with what you've told me. Good luck. We're depending on you. Okay. Ha! Oh. Ok, niveau 20, super. Ok, donc les quêtes. Trouver Dimas et lui parler des notes d'Hippocrate. Le médecin est un alcooliste, il est dans la partie non derrière. Hein? On va aller au plus près, hein. Donc, Alexios a découvert Hippocrate au milieu du... Afin de sauver une personne mourante, il avait besoin de notes détenues par un médecin de fort voisin. Let's go Allez, on y va. Oups. Ah, c'est le fort là-bas. Ella, Hippocrates' notes are well guarded. Why? Ok, niveau 20. Eh bah ben dis donc, il y a beaucoup de monde hein. Tyrians, built by the Cyclopes, or so the legend goes. Bah, c'est ça pour donner ton poste. Don't make me stop you myself. Voilà. What are you doing here? Hippocrates sent me. Your commander stole his notes, and I think you have them. The ones written by the great Hippocrates himself. I'm sorry, they were burned in the last attack. What? You Nani? The medical tent was burned. At least I memorized the notes before we lost them. Now transcribe them when I have time, or when the war subsides. Then. Tu veux les transcrire maintenant tout de suite. Patient Hippocrates is treating will die without your help. I have a patient right here who needs my help. Can't someone else take care of this one? I'm the only doctor here. Now let me work. 
I'll wait here for you to finish. If I leave, what's stopping you from running away? Thinking like a mercenary. Guess I shouldn't be surprised. Then make yourself useful and bring me my bone forceps. Some idiot or another's always borrowing them. Then you'll come treat Hippocrates' his patient. You have my word. I'll go get your bone forceps. Allez, allez. Nice. Allez, allez, venez. Oula, 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 oula. Trop de monde. Trop de monde. Trop de monde, trop de monde, trop de monde. Établir piège. Voilà. Alors moi il monte par là. Ah! <laughs> 
，不玩了。哇哈哈哈！Qui se bat avec qui Ils se battent entre eux là, on est d'accord Battez vous entre vous. Moi ça me va. Mais putain, il y a combien de mercenaires Je finirai par les avoir, mais faut être un peu patient. Tu les mercenaires. Oula. Oups. Ouais, dégage. Allez, viens. Comment j'ai esquivé ça Personne ne sait. Allez, dégage. Ouais, ouais, beaucoup de blabla pour rien. Voilà. J'adore. Merci beaucoup. Est-ce que ça marche avec toi Oups. Allez, viens. Ah, 
<rire> Ça dégage. Ouais, ouais, merci. What? Ouais, dégage. Ouais, dégage. Ça n'a pas de sens. Ouh, dommage. Je suis là. Voilà. Oh putain, putain, je vais mourir comme un con. Allez, viens. Je suis là. Hein. Et bah voilà. Maintenant on peut. Voilà. Donc, on va profiter pour nettoyer les lieux. Voilà. <rire> Donc, piller un trésor, enfin, piller deux trésors et brûler un vitamin de guerre. Ok. Voilà. Ok, il reste deux trésors.
Putain, déjà, Argolis Ok, mais il reste un trésor. Voilà. Dix mille. Oh là là. Quand même. Là, on retourne voir Hippocrate pour pouvoir lui donner la méthode pour sauver ses patients de la maladie sacrée. Excusez-moi, je vérifie si j'enregistre. C'est quand même dommage. Ah. Hippocrate. The importance of diet to maintaining one's health cannot be overstated. What good can one apple really do? <laughs> well, taken daily, they can keep the doctor away. But two more serious matters. I know why you're here. You're looking for your mother. You remember her? I was young then. I didn't know how to help. I turned her away. But her look of determination and despair was born into my mind. It has never left me, and it never will. After, I swore to Apollo that I wouldn't turn away another patient, that I'd dedicate my life to the cause. She made an impression on me. Your brave mother did. Sebo. She would be happy to know that. I sent your mother to the sanctuary of Asclepius. Tell the elder priest a treatment for the sacred disease will soon be available to any patient who needs it. Then he may talk to you. Thank you for everything, Hippocrates. I'll go see him now. Allez. Mais, mais où le trésor Ça le trésor
Ok. Donc, nouvelle quête. What? <laughs> okay. Why? Nice. That's right. All right. Eh ben, il a du mal, hein. Ouais, voilà. bon, on va d'abord essayer de 150 mètres. Sanctuary of Asclepius, god of medicine. Casting creatures. I'd rather trust the physician. Okay, let's get past. Your purification bath. You'll have to come back another time. I'm here for information. In that case, you can go straight to Hades. I need to know about the Spartan woman who came through here many years ago. Did that eagle of yours shit in your ears? I'm under strict orders not to talk to any mercenaries, especially not about Spartan women. Or injured babies. My eagle will tear out your tongue, priest. Forgive me, not the tongue. Not like Midon. 
Chrissy's threatened anyone who speaks to the Eagle Bearer. Did she? Tell me about the woman and her baby, and I won't drown you in your bathhouse. How's that for a threat? Please, no! There is already a corpse in there. <laughs> what are you talking about? Snakes! Snakes? They're everywhere! Must have escaped from the Tholos. We keep them for treatments, but they invaded the bathhouse. This snakes killed someone? A patient was purifying himself when they slithered in. Turns out he's terrified of snakes. Fell over dead. Now the snakes have made him their home. What if I took care nice. of the snake problem? Would you talk to me then? Oh, most definitely. The purification bath is crucial in the path towards healing. What does taking a bath have to do with healing the sick? Asclepios only visits the dreams of the pure. When the sick arrive, they offer sacrifice, cleanse their bodies in the bathhouse. Only then do we let them rest in the Abaddon, where Asclepios appears and heals them. How did all these snakes... Blame Dorios! He's supposed to keep them in the Tholos. Patients with afflictions of the mind are healed by the snakes. Their tongues are like kisses from the gods. Mm -hmm. I'll clear out these snakes in no time. Icarus could use a good feast. Try not to kill them. Dorios will be furious if you sacred snakes get chopped to beats. Then how am I supposed to? Bah oui, comment, comment tu veux? Are drawn to the bath heat. Flood them with cold water, and they'll slither back to their hole. There's an underground pipe that may help you. I'll take care of yours. Okay. Non, c'est là. Oh, mais ça, c'est autre chose. the pipe. Opening it should flood the bath and get rid of the snakes. Attends. Il y avait, il y avait déjà des canalisations Enfin, ça ne m'étonne pas énormément parce que les Romains l'ont déjà fait. Mais... C'est quand même incroyable de se rendre compte des fois des avancées technologiques des peuples très anciens. Et tu te dis, oh c'est pas possible qu'ils aient inventé ça à cette époque-là. Et bah si. Normalement, oui. La formation. I actually don't know anything. Mais quel con. Before my time. The man who does know is Mithun, but he won't tell you. He won't tell anyone anything. <laughs> <laughs> C'est ce qu'on va voir. C'est ce qu'on va voir, petit con. Snakes. At least I got a name. Mithun. 21. Super. Ah, 
Coucou. Greetings, young one. Come to offer us Clipios a sacrifice? No. But I'm searching for a Spartan mother who may have. The great goddess Ira guides many mothers to the sacred place. Surely I'm too feeble to remember them all. What are these stone slabs for? Ah bah c'est pour dire les gens qui sont passés par là. Moi des registres. We document all who pass through their illnesses, treatments, so that the glory of Asclepius can be celebrated. Then I don't need your memory. I just need to find the right stone. Um, yes, of course. That's very wise indeed. If only I had the time to help you. Je vais te faire souffrir. Hein. Listen, I'm not here to hurt you. I'm just looking for my mother. It's Chrysis. She's got every priest in the sanctuary under her thumb, and she'll squash anyone who feeds information to the eagle bearer. Then don't tell me anything. Just bring me to the stone that can. Follow me then. Quickly. We must be discreet. Lead the way. Je vais quand même m'aider, hein. Ah, attendez. Je vais quand même aider, c'est très mignon. This way, over here. If anyone is watching, they'll have my head. What kind of sanctuary isn't safe for its priests? Times have changed, Eagle Bearer. Je suis vraiment désolé. Voilà. Ah, I remember this tale, written during the time of the great Elod revolt. You would have been only a child. I don't need the history, just the details. It tells the tale of a woman with worms in her throat. Asclepios took off her head so we could remove her. Ouais, va vite parce que là il veut me tuer là. <rire> euh, ouais, attends un petit peu s'il te plaît. Ouais. <rire> Le mec il est en train de m'attendre. Je, je ne sais jamais quel est le bouton pour esquiver une attaque quand tu es par terre. Definitely not the right one. I wonder what Hippocrates would think of these treatments. Hippocrates is a fine healer. Showed so much promise. Showed? He's healing the sick right now. He puts too much faith in his hands and not enough in the gods. When it comes to life and death, I prefer hands. Are all the testimonies so outrageous? Writers today, Thucydides, Evripides, the petulant Aristophanes, all of them try for realism. But what really inspires is greatness, magic, gods. This one tells the tale of a man with sword wounds. Mais je, ce n'est pas un homme, justement. C'est une femme. 
Donc ça ne sert pas à grand chose quand même. I'm losing mine. Tell me about Chrysis. A very powerful, dangerous woman. But it was not always so. She was abandoned here as a child and taken in by the priests. Taught the ways of the gods. She learned uh, very quickly. It was very strong-willed. And uh, before too long, it was the priests who listened to her. She was loved. But there's an anger in her heart that could not be soothed. So, when her methods turned to madness, anyone who opposed her got, um... Got what? I've already said too much. And what about this one? Let me guess. It tells the tale of a blind woman. Bah, vu que c'est une cinématique, euh, je pense que c'est elle. It reads... Of Sparta. Came here with child. Sought pity from the gods. Why is most of it scratched out? Oh, uh, I'm... I'll just tell you. I know this one by heart. The Spartan woman arrived filthy and bleeding from her travels. We cared for her, gave her food, a bath, and she left. Where she went, I do not know. The child could not be saved. Who does know where she went? We've been spotted. Meet me later, near the olive tree of Heracles, at the entrance of the sanctuary. I may have something for you. And what do we have here? A priest and a mercenary out for a friendly stroll? May the gods be with you, Plistos. I was just on my way to the archives when this Mystheus bumped into me. Is that so? And what were you both chatting about so fervently, might I ask? I'm filthy, and could use a good bath. The kind priest here was pointing me in the direction of the bathhouse. On va pas euh, um, dévoiler yes, des informations confidentielles. Correct. The bathhouse is right over there. Now, if you'll excuse me. The baths are for healing the sick, not for washing the blood off one's hands. Leave. Okay. Je peux le tuer. Désolé les vegan. Oula, 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 oula.
pour monter. Oh, c'est dommage, ils viennent pas. Quand même, battez-vous. Faudra sauter. Il over there. That old priest hiding by the tree. Normalement, je peux la tuer. Allez, allez, allez. Parfait. Oops. 
Voilà. Je sais pas quand j'ai fait. Comment il a réussi à lancer ça sans, sans animation Mais bon, passons. Oula. Oula. Là, on peut continuer. Oula, je pense que la caméra, elle est vraiment partie là. Ouais, elle est vraiment partie là. <rire> voilà. Ça fait déjà 1h10. Ok. Donc un ennemi 23 je peux le battre. Euh, 10 ennemis 23 euh, je pense pas. The tree of Heracles. I'm not sure if it's loved more for its legend or its olives. Now, where's that priest? Il est là. I thank you for your discretion, Eagle Bearer. Chrysis has many eyes and ears throughout the sanctuary. What else can you tell me about the Spartan woman and child? The woman left the child's blanket behind. We tried to return it, but it was too painful a memory for her. Where did she go? What happened to the child? So, Chrysis was right. You knew the rules, Timoxenos. You Oula. suffer her wrath. Plistos, please. Get behind me, please. <laughs> Plistos, please. Uh, what? Who said that? <rire> tu commences mal, mon gars. Et toi, t'es qui euh, Ouais, ouais, eh, allo, allo.
Oula. C'est quoi ce jeu la Matrix Ah ils se battent entre eux Mais pourquoi Caca 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 les cadeaux Ça dégage. Maintenant, je dois faire quoi Bah, je dois faire quoi Ok. Bon, bah, je pense que j'aurais complété la la mission. Ouais. Ok, d'accord. Bon, bah en tout cas, euh... voici les premières missions à Arcos pour essayer de trouver des informations sur notre mère. Euh, donc ça fait déjà 1h15, je pense que c'est un bon moment pour arrêter. Parce qu'après on complétera la, la dernière mission et on verra où est-ce que ça nous mène qu'on aura recueilli toutes les informations. Donc, euh, je vous remercie encore une fois de suivre cette série chaque semaine. Et euh, je vous dis euh, à la semaine prochaine. Allez, ciao